Hello everybody, and today I'm giving my thoughts on the Nintendo press conference at E3 2019. This was the best press conference that I've seen, because it showed a lot of games that I was interested more in uh, when compared to the other ones. Let's move on. Luigi's Mansion 3 is coming out, bitches. I can't wait. I'm a big fan of the first game. I mean, I didn't really like Dark Moon very much, so fuck that noise. Especially with its Super Mario 64 level setup. Instead of it being more open and you just find shit in advance from one point to the next. So, yeah, Luigi's Mansion 3 has a lot of new gameplay mechanics. I really like it, and I can't wait to play it. Then, uh, some other news. Uh, there's Dragon Quest characters that, as well as Banjo-Kazooie, are gonna be coming to Smash Bros. Ultimate. I am so happy. Super Smash Bros. Ultimate is already a really good game, despite it being spammy in some regards when it comes to certain characters, but then again, fighting games are always spammy, so moving on. There's going to be a sequel announced to Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Since I like the first game, I'd really be interested in the sequel. Then there's a new Animal Crossing game that's going to be coming out called Animal Crossing New Horizons. I really only like the Animal Crossing game on the 3DS, which is uh, New Leaf. I like it a lot, so I'm definitely looking forward to this one. Uh, then there's Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3, which for some fucking reason is still an exclusive to the Nintendo Switch. I am pissed off about that. I like the Nintendo Switch, I do, but that game should be at least on PC and consoles as well. So far, it's an exclusive only to the system until it gets released elsewhere. Uh, then there's Fire Emblem Three Houses. It's going to be coming out July 26th. I don't really know anything about it, aside from the fact that the uh, cinematic trailer looked really cool. I'm interested in that. Then there's Trials of Mana, which is coming out for the Switch. Um, that looks really good. Along with that, the original first three Mana games are going to be coming to Switch, and that's going to be good too. I would really love to play the original Secret of Mana, because I heard so many good things about it. Now moving on to what is average. Legend of Zelda Link's Awakening is getting a remake. I'll have to rent it first. Then there's Pokemon Sword and Shield. This looks pretty cool. I'm not a big Pokemon fan, but I know that's going to deliver a lot of fun. Then you have Daemon X Machina, which looks like something straight out of the Zone of the Enders games. I mean, it looks like it's part of that universe anyway. Very fast paced, mech battles and shit. Looks awesome. Uh, then there's Panzer Dragoon, based on the trailer alone. I'm confused about that one. It's either a cinematic trailer or it's showcasing gameplay that makes me think that this is going to be a ripoff of Crimson Dragon for the Xbox One. So I'm a bit skeptical. And then there's Astral Chain, which is made by Platinum Games. Uh, that looks like it will be really fun. I'm definitely gonna have to rent that one. And that's pretty much it for the Nintendo Showcase. While they lacked details with some games they showed, they made up for it in the long run. They did this by showing a lot of games that looked really fun and interesting. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you all for tuning in, and I'll see you all in the next videos.